Now that the city of Bemidji has approved the restoration of its Carnegie Library, an aggressive timeline is being put in place. A Josh Peterson breaks down the project's deadlines. After the final vote was read to approve the Carnegie Library restoration project, the council chambers erupted with applause. But there is little time to celebrate as the project will be a race against the clock. A lot of historic requirements, you want to um, respect all the finishes. They call it the historic fabric. So the plaster, the woodwork, um, you want to maintain and preserve all of that. The Carnegie Restoration Project faces a very aggressive timeline, meaning that one year from now, the project should already be 100% complete. With grants that need to be used by specific deadlines, it will be a rapid transformation over the next year. Restoration of the exterior masonry, the brickwork, the stonework, that all needs to be completed by the end of this year, so end of December. And that's all very doable. What saved this 108-year-old building was a passionate grassroots effort to preserve a piece of Bemidji history. We're going to actually see a finished, original-looking Carnegie Library back where it should be in the city of Bemidji. But just because the project is moving forward doesn't mean the fundraising has stopped. With over $2 million raised so far, fundraising efforts will continue. I think that there's going to be a lot of people now who will recognize that it's really going to happen, and it's their time now to step up and, and support it. With Library Park set to keep its library, the rich history of the Carnegie will live on for generations to come. In Bemidji, Josh Peterson, Lakeland News. The Carnegie Restoration Project is expected to begin in early August with the entire project completed by the end of June in 2019. If you enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.